Welcome back. Beautiful morning across the Twin Tiers. That is if you don't have to step outside. It's one of those nice window mornings where you look out. Oh, a nice, bright, sunny day, but temperatures awfully cold. Single digits for most couple spots actually below zero this morning. It's going to take a little while as we progress through the morning to warm things up. Only up to 11 by 9, but uh, heading into the afternoon hours, we'll do a little bit better. That uh, strong March sunshine will certainly help. But again, frigid start both above and below zero this morning. Officially at the Elmira Corning Regional Airport, three above. Wasn't a record. The record is eight below zero, but it's the coldest we've been in almost a month. Uh, plenty of sunshine today. High temperatures in the 30s, 33 or 5 degree guarantee. More clouds arriving tomorrow. Rain likely by Tuesday. And by, again, early next week, we're talking temperatures well above average. So big jump here as we go through the next 24 to 48 hours. Four right now in Elmira. The winds are calm, so not much of a wind chill, at least in Elmira. But up in Ithaca, four below is the actual temperature. And with a breeze at just five miles an hour, it's dropping the wind chill value to 15 degrees below zero. Other temperatures across the area right now, a lot of single digits out there. Seven below, that's the cold spot over in Bradford, Pennsylvania. Williamsport at 11, Syracuse checking in at two above zero. Locally here in the Twin Tiers, couple pockets below zero still. Spencer and Ithaca, single digits below zero. Elsewhere, a little bit warmer, but not by much. One above in Corning, three right now in Wellsboro, and three in Hornell. So heading out to church uh, this morning, Definitely want to throw on a heavier jacket because again, we haven't seen temperatures this cold in a while. Now, yesterday morning it was seven above, but you had to head all the way back to February 9th to see temperatures rivaling where we are this morning. A few clouds drifting across the Finger Lake or the Great Lakes right now, and this cloud cover will head our way by mid afternoon. So just a few clouds by then, but until then, a lot of sunshine. And notice by one o'clock, we're already up to 31 degrees. 33 is where we're headed for a five degree guarantee today. Not quite where we should be for this time of year, but better than yesterday. How about that 50 for tomorrow's high temperature? A warm front will lift through and 55 by Tuesday with a pretty good chance for rain by then. Let's uh, map out that precipitation for you here. Nothing to worry about for today. Just a lot of sunshine and temperatures into the 30s. Tonight, some more clouds head our way. We initially drop off into the teens for lows, but then Bump them back up here through the overnight period late tonight for tomorrow. A lot of clouds around, but notice the temperatures low 50s, maybe a spotty shower or sprinkle coming through during the afternoon. A lot of that kind of evaporating, though, before it reaches the ground. Much better chance for rain on Tuesday. 33 is where we're headed today. It'll take a while, but we'll get there. 15 for a low temperature tonight. Partly cloudy skies. First warning 7 day forecast showing much warmer weather moving in early next week. Look for rain showers. Pretty good bet Tuesday. We're dry Wednesday and Thursday, and then some mixed rain and snow showers uh, towards the next weekend with temperatures in the low 40s.